Alright, hi guys. I'm just going to do a quick review of the So Good Vanilla. Now I bought the So Good, actually my mother had bought the So Good regular, and I really like that soy milk a lot. I found it was very drinkable, pleasant taste, really was happy with this. Um, this is the vanilla flavor, so I guess it's got a bit more sugar. I'm curious if it's going to be uh, too sweet or maybe even better to just drink, like for my daughter and stuff, they might like, well she might like that better. Um, they have a chocolate, vanilla, strawberry as well flavors. I did see the chocolate at the store. I got this because it was on sale for $2.99 and I had a coupon for a dollar off. So I got this 1.89 gallon uh, container for two bucks, which is really good. A buck ninety-nine actually. So what's in it? Filtered water, soy protein, Isolate, whole soybeans, cane sugar, corn, syrup, solids, fructose, canola oil, tricalcium, phosphate, potassium, citrate, natural vanilla flavor, brown rice syrup, dipotassium phosphate, magnesium phosphate, salt, carrageenan, zinc gluconate, ascorbic acid, niacin, pentothenate, riboflavin, B6, vitamin A, thiamine, folicin, vitamin D2, and vitamin B12. if you can see that clearly. That's what I just read. And this has more calories. It's, it's sweeter and for every one cup there's 140 calories. And 6 gram, sorry, 6% 6 fat, 3% saturated fat, 1.4 grams of polyunsaturated fat, um, 0.6 omega-6, 0.2 omega-3, 2 grams of monounsaturated, zero cholesterol, 110 milligrams of sodium, 380 milligrams of potassium, 21 grams of carbohydrates, zero fiber, 12 grams of sugar, six grams of protein, 10% vitamin A, 4% vitamin C. Okay, so this has vitamin C. 30% um, calcium, 8% iron, 45% vitamin D, 8% thiamine, riboflavin, 25%, 8% of niacin, B6, 6%, Folicin, 6%, B12, 50%, pentothenate, 15%, phosphorus, 25%, magnesium, 10%, and zinc, 10%. Okay, I'm going to try this. And um, I'm having... You know, you want, sometimes you want to have milk. You want to have milk when you have, like, uh, I'm having something chocolatey, so I just want to have a cup of milk to go with it, and let's see how I like this. The plain was good. I really liked it a lot, so maybe there's no need to get the flavored one with the extra calories, but here, let's let's see how it is. This is really good, actually. So good is seriously so good. This reminds me, I guess, because of the, the vanilla flavor of like an ice cream. So this would be really a great choice, like in a milkshake um, kind of a beverage. Maybe this, this is really, it's definitely, you can taste that sweet vanilla. It's like a nice, it's like a milkshake flavor. That's exactly what it's like. It's like a milkshake flavor. They really seem... I can't remember exactly how the plain one tasted. I, I knew it was, I just remember it was delicious. So they actually seem like they're able to sort of replicate, I don't know, the dairy flavor maybe. But in this case, definitely like a vanilla ice cream. I really like this. I like this a lot. Um, I think my daughter will like this a lot. So that, um, I'll see how she does and I'll let you guys know in the comments. But this is the kind of thing where... You know, she's not as keen on some of the, the coconut and the almond milks, and she doesn't mind soy, but I think this soy milk, with this nice flavor to it, will be something that she'll probably be happy about drinking. Okay, guys, I really like this. Again, more calories uh, in it. If you're going to make things like ice cream, like when I make spinach ice cream in my blend tech, I would be happy to use this. I think this is a good option, even for your smoothies and just to drink. But, uh, of course, they're so good plain is also really good without the extra sweetness to it, but like I said, kids might prefer this, and I think my daughter will, and I'll let you know in the comments, and thanks for watching.